It's time for entertainment news. Nigerian artists make the 2022 Soul Train Awards nomination list. The 2022 BET Soul Train Awards is right around the corner and the organizers have revealed the nominations for this year's ceremony. Our very own Bonoboy, Whiskey, Thames, Fireboy and CK are all well represented on this list in various categories. Bonoboy was nominated in the Best mm -hmm. R&B and Soul Male mm -hmm. Artist category while also grabbing nominations in the Song of the Year category. The Ashford and Simpson Songwriters Awards category and Video of the Year category for his hit song, Last Last. CK, Fireboy, DML and Thames were also nominated in the Best New Artist category. While Thames, on the other hand, had another nomination in the Best R&B and Soul Female Artist category. For his collaboration with American singer Chris Brown on Call Me Every Day, Whiskey was nominated in the Best Dance Performance category and Best Collaboration category. Beyoncé and Mary J. Blash led this year's nomination list with seven notes apiece, while Ari Lennox trails, trails close behind with six nominations. Meanwhile, Lizzo and Chris Brown each earned five notes each, and our very own Bonaboy follows with four nominations. Just so you know, the Soul Train Music Awards is an annual award ceremony that recognizes and rewards excellence in African-American culture, music, and entertainment. The event will be hosted by the award-winning American actor and comedian Dion Cole, and it is scheduled to hold on the 13th of November in Las Vegas, United States of America. Okay, I think we'll first start off by saying congratulations to every single person who was nominated for the Soul Train. That's actually very major. But extra congratulations yes. to our very own. Like, every time I hear Berna, I'm hearing Thames, I'm just hearing good things, and I'm just very proud of them. Yeah. No surprises there that they were nominated. And yeah, hopefully they pick it up. But it's Berna's um, video, video of the year award for me do nomination it, because it. I'm like, he knew what he was doing when he was shooting that video. Very strategic. Congrats to them. Yeah, congratulations to them. And you can say that again. I mean, across all of the awards that we have known and their big awards, and they have been mentioning these names, uh, they have been including us. So we love yep. the spotlight on Nigeria right about now. Uh, it is up, up, up from here onwards. Yes. And, uh, well, is there any award they don't even nominate Lizzo? <laughs> you know, I talked about this before, and, uh, you know, somebody was of the opinion that, yes, it shows what people don't even really talk about, and, you know, that needs attention and all that. Congratulations to her. Mm -hmm. I like people who are strategic, who actually map out things, and, uh, you know, they reap the fruit at the end of today. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm just happy that um, Afrobeats as a whole is now accepted worldwide. I mm -hmm. mean, it's now a mainstream um, genre. Um, and then we're not only having just one person as, as opposed as mm -hmm. before. Now we're having like five Afrobeat artists being nominated and uh, um, vying for the coveted spots with the top American artists. So yep. it's amazing. It's just to tell you that um, we've actually made it to the mainstream and it can only get better from here. It can definitely mm -hmm. only get better. Very excited for all of them.